Sony has consistently been a pioneer in the world of digital imaging, known for delivering products that push the boundaries of camera technology. Now, all eyes are on the upcoming Sony FX4, expected to be released in Q2 2025. This next-generation compact cinema camera is positioned as the successor to the highly successful Sony FX3, a model that quickly became a favorite among filmmakers, vloggers, and content creators thanks to its perfect blend of compact design and professional-grade performance. With the FX4, Sony aims to take that legacy even further, introducing innovative features, improved usability, and enhanced video capabilities that could make it a defining release in the cinema camera landscape. The original Sony FX3, launched in 2021, was praised for being one of the most accessible cinema cameras with full-frame capabilities. Borrowing heavily from the Sony Alpha series, particularly the A7S III, it managed to deliver outstanding video features in a lightweight, compact body. Its success was fueled by its adaptability for handheld shooting, gimbal setups, and even drone use, offering creative flexibility for both amateur and professional filmmakers. Now, with the FX4 on the horizon, Sony is expected to maintain the winning formula of portability while making critical refinements in response to user feedback. The Sony FX4 is rumored to retain a compact and lightweight form factor, similar to the FX3, but it may come with enhanced ergonomics. Filmmakers often work in fast-paced environments and rely heavily on tactile controls, and the FX4 is expected to deliver improvements such as a more comfortable grip and better button placement. These ergonomic updates will likely make the camera easier to operate during long shoots, particularly for professionals who prefer to shoot handheld or in run-and-gun scenarios. One of the most anticipated additions to the FX4 is the possible inclusion of an optional electronic viewfinder. Unlike the FX3, which lacks an EVF and relies solely on the rear LCD screen for monitoring, the FX4 could bridge the gap between traditional cinema cameras and hybrid mirrorless models by offering this feature. An EVF can be invaluable when shooting in bright conditions or when precision framing is necessary. This move would appeal to a broader range of users, including those who demand more traditional shooting experiences. In terms of thermal management, Sony appears to be refining the camera's internal cooling system. While the FX3 featured an active cooling system with a built-in fan, reports suggest that the FX4 may move to a fanless design with more efficient passive cooling. This could result in quieter operation, a significant benefit for professionals recording audio on set, and improved durability during extended filming sessions, even in hot environments. At the heart of the Sony FX4 is its rumored 12-megapixel full-frame sensor. On the surface, that resolution might seem low compared to other cameras, but this is a strategic decision by Sony. Lower megapixel counts mean larger individual pixels, which enhance light sensitivity and allow for superior low-light performance and dynamic range. These attributes are critical for filmmakers who often work in unpredictable or challenging lighting conditions. The FX4 is expected to deliver stunning image quality with minimal noise, even at high ISO levels, making it a strong performer for night shoots, documentaries, or event videography. Perhaps one of the most game-changing rumors about the FX4 is the potential inclusion of a global shutter. Unlike traditional rolling shutters, which can produce distortion during fast movement or camera pans, a global shutter captures the entire frame simultaneously. This would eliminate the jello or skew effect often seen in action scenes or quick handheld movements. If Sony includes this technology in the FX4, it would mark a significant leap forward, bringing capabilities typically reserved for high-end cinema rigs into a much smaller and more affordable package. The FX4 is also expected to support 4K video recording at up to 80 frames per second, enabling filmmakers to capture ultra-smooth slow-motion footage with pristine detail. Although there are whispers of possible 8K recording, this feature is yet to be confirmed. Even without 8K, the FX4 is shaping up to be a powerhouse in 4K production, offering internal 10-bit 4-2-2 recording. This level of color fidelity and detail will give filmmakers substantial flexibility in post-production, especially for color grading and visual effects. Another major enhancement could come in the form of built-in electronic ND filters. This feature, commonly found in higher-end cinema cameras, allows for seamless exposure control without needing to screw on external filters. Internal NDs enable smoother transitions and give operators greater creative control over depth of field, even in bright conditions. If this feature is indeed part of the FX4, it will drastically improve shooting efficiency and elevate the camera's standing among professionals. One of the most requested features from Sony users has been internal RAW recording. 
While the FX3 supports ProRes RAW via external recorders, having RAW capture built into the FX4 would be a massive advantage. It would eliminate the need for external devices, streamline camera setups, and make post-production workflows more efficient. However, due to technical and licensing restrictions related to RAW codecs, it's still uncertain whether Sony can deliver this feature natively. Still, even without internal RAW, the FX4's advanced codecs, possibly including ZAVK HS, ZAVK SI, or XOCN, are expected to offer excellent performance and flexibility for demanding projects. The FX4 is also anticipated to provide smooth integration with Sony's Catalyst software, which allows for precise stabilization and metadata-assisted editing. These tools are incredibly useful for creators who want to speed up their workflows and maintain quality during rapid turnaround projects. Furthermore, Sony's continued improvements in color science mean that the FX4 will likely deliver beautiful skin tones, vibrant yet natural colors, and smooth tonal transitions. These characteristics are crucial for filmmakers aiming to achieve cinematic results straight out of the camera without the need for excessive post-processing. Battery life and efficiency are always critical for filmmakers working on tight schedules, and the FX4 is rumored to include a more power-efficient design. Thanks to advancements in processing and thermal management, it could offer longer recording times on a single charge. This would be a welcome improvement for fieldwork or documentary shoots where access to power may be limited. The price of the Sony FX4 is expected to land between $3,800 and $4,200, a modest increase over the FX3. However, considering the number of new and upgraded features, this price seems more than justified. Sony has always been competitive in terms of pricing, offering excellent value for money, and the FX4 appears to continue that tradition. Positioned between hybrid mirrorless models and large cinema rigs, it will appeal to a wide variety of filmmakers, from solo creators to professional crews. The FX4 is also expected to maintain core strengths from the FX3 that users have come to rely on. These include 5-axis in-body image stabilization for smooth handheld shots and a fully articulating LCD touchscreen, features that remain invaluable for vloggers and single-operator filmmakers. By retaining these elements, Sony ensures continuity for existing FX3 users while raising the bar for what can be expected from its compact cinema line. Ultimately, the Sony FX4 is shaping up to be much more than a simple follow-up, it represents a bold step forward in Sony's vision for compact cinema cameras. By potentially combining features like a global shutter, internal ND filters, improved color science, and enhanced thermal efficiency, the FX4 may redefine what's possible in a small form factor. As competition intensifies from brands like Canon and Panasonic, Sony is clearly positioning the FX4 to stand out, not just as an incremental update, but as a new benchmark in the segment. With a release expected in mid-2025, anticipation is high for what Sony will officially unveil. If the rumors and early insights prove accurate, the Sony FX4 is destined to become a top choice for filmmakers who need a powerful, portable, and professional solution. Whether you're shooting a commercial, a documentary, or a cinematic short, the FX4 looks set to offer the tools and performance to bring your creative vision to life. As we await its official debut, the excitement surrounding the Sony FX4 speaks volumes about its potential to reshape the future of filmmaking.